shall reflect on the life of Saint Catherine Labor. Baptized Zoe, this saint, who was the ninth of seventeen children of Pierre Labor and his wife Madeleine Louise Gontard, was born on the 2nd of May 1806. Since she received no formal education, she was able to yet sustain her desire to become a religious in the face of her father's opposition. She did this by means of daily participation in the Eucharist even as she kept the house for her father and brothers. In the year 1830, Zoe entered the novitiate of the Sisters of Charity of St. Vincent de Paul. Here she took the name Catherine. Here her supernatural manifestations began with the visible presence of Christ in the Blessed Sacrament and his apparition as King on Trinity Sunday. Then there followed three remarkable revelations of Our Lady which were set down in writing by her under the direction of a confessor. At the second apparition, a voice was heard telling her to have a medal made with this as a model. It should be worn around the neck and great graces will be given to all who wear it with confidence. Our Lady explained further that the rays emanating from her hands symbolize the graces which she bestowed upon those who asked for them. On the reverse of the medal were to appear the letter M with a superimposed cross, the Sacred Heart of Jesus and that of Mary. The secret of these apparitions was known only to Catherine's confessor and although word soon began to spread when the medal was coined and distributed in large numbers, the sister of Poultry Yard managed to conceal her part in them the rest of her life. Marvelous cures and spiritual favors began to be reported almost immediately in connection with the medal. The remarkable conversion of an atheistic and rapidly anti-Catholic Jew in 1842 being the most startling instance so that it came to be popularly called the Miraculous Medal. The children of Mary Sodality whose members wear the Miraculous Medal as their badge was also formed in accordance with Our Lady's request. St. Catherine died on the 31st of December 1876, beatified on the 20th of May 1933, she was canonized on the 27th of July 1947 by Pope Pius XII.